Syria says President Obama is confused and lacks evidence it used chemical weapons. Elizabeth Palmer is the only American network correspondent inside the capital city of Damascus. She has just spoken with the country's deputy foreign minister. Elizabeth joins us now. Elizabeth, what was his reaction to the president's decision to go to Congress? Dr. Faisal al Makdad, the deputy foreign minister, told me that President Obama's decision to seek Congress's approval for strikes uh, is evidence that he's, he knows it's a dangerous responsibility. Syria obviously hopes that Congress won't back the White House so that some other diplomatic response to the chemical weapons will have to be found. The Middle East is already on fire now. And uh, we think any wisdom in the United States, and we hope the Congress will exercise this will, wisdom will not allow the United States to tarnish its image once again in wars in the Middle East. I also asked the Deputy Foreign Minister how Syria would respond to U.S. strikes. He said, I'm not a military man, I can't tell you exactly, but all options are on the table and pointed out that Syria had still an intact and strong military. I asked specifically, would you attack Israel? And predictably, he refused to be drawn on that. Elizabeth Palmer in Damascus. Thanks, Liz.